My name is Steve Bonick, and I work for TriMinex Holdings LLC, and my title is Information Security Manager, a logarithm uh, sim. The primary use case is really tying all of our log sources together between all of our Windows servers, network devices, and we've recently added all of our cloud uh, infrastructure as well. So it's really tying all those together, correlating all those logs, and giving us one central pane of glass, really as it relates to all of our logging activities. Um, I think the biggest thing is tying all of our log sources together, whereas there was a lot of manual work to, before of reviewing Windows logs or you know firewall logs, bringing it all together so that way my team, the information security team, as well as the infrastructure team can kind of view all of that from a single pane of, pane of glass and see everything that's going on in the environment. As of now, we're not using all the full analytics capabilities that we know the logarithm sim can do. So it's one of the things, we're areas of, that we need to improve on. We have all of our log sources in there. Now making sure that we're getting the value of the, all that together is something we still need to work on. So. Yeah, I think the biggest way that it's improved us from an organizational standpoint is giving us a single view into all of our log sources and all of our infrastructure devices, whereas before we didn't ever have that, and it was always a, a hodgepodge of stuff put together. So I think it's the, the best thing is that it brings everything together so we can leave you all one view of it. So. Yeah, playbooks are definitely something that I see a lot of value in, so I look forward to when we do get upgraded to be able to using those playbooks. I think that's a way of, of automating and making sure that we're standardized in the way that me and my team are, are utilizing the logarithm sim. I think playbooks are very valuable. Stability has been great. We have not had any unplanned outages. All the upgrades that we have done have gone as expected, so from that standpoint, stability has been great. Scalability has been great as well. Um, we've got a very disparate environment, and the we, the original servers that we have are from three years ago are still in place. We haven't had any performance issues at all, so it scales to our solution, understanding that as we bring on additional devices, we know that it will scale up to be even bigger than where we're at right now. Uh, tech support's been great. Every time we work with them on any upgrades or any questions about any of the anything we want to add a new log source or whatever, they've been excellent on that, and they're always right on top of it and always get us to where we need to go. So. Yeah, so I was involved, actually, uh, one of the it was one of the first products I bought when I started at the company. We didn't have a SIM, didn't have any, really from a monitoring standpoint, didn't have anything. So Logarithm was really the first major product that we bought, and the, and the, up the installation was awesome. I mean, it went as expected, moved it along quickly, and it provided value as soon as we were done with the installation. So the install was, was amazing. Uh, we're, we're about 20 different log source types. Um, I mean, all total log sources, we're probably in the 400, 500 range. So, I mean, it, it's, it has a log source. There are log source types for everything that we have right now. One of the challenges we have had is adding all of our cloud infrastructure in there as well. So I know that's something that Logarithm is working on. Uh, we're doing about 2,000 messages per second. Yeah, from a metric standpoint, we really aren't tracking our mean time to respond or mean time to detect as of now. That's kind of something that I want to get better at to kind of formalize that process. So as of now, it's hard to say how much it has, but I know from a, just from a uh, anecdotal standpoint, I can guarantee that we, we're doing a lot better in responding now than we did before, before we had the SIM in place. Um, from an improvement standpoint, I would say the, the thing that I like to see Logger to do a better job of that is staying ahead of the curve as it relates to like things like cloud. It seems like from that standpoint that maybe the cloud stuff was a little bit of an afterthought or wasn't done kind of as people started to move to cloud quicker. It's one of those things of where we kind of are doing it now, but it seems like some of the, how the cloud connections are still buying, kind of being created as we go. So I think that's one area I think they can improve in. So when we looked at uh, putting a SIM in place, we kind of uh, realized that I wanted somebody that was kind of, a, kind of, I guess what I would call a neutral vendor where they're not you know, tied to specific vendors. You know, we wanted to make sure that with the SIM we were buying would monitor all the devices that we had in place. So finding somebody that's kind of an independent, not tied to specific hardware manufacturers is really important to us to make sure that you know, the SIM could monitor everything that we had in place. So I think from a security program maturity level, Logarithm really got us started in that direction. As I mentioned, you know, it was one of the first products we bought. And when we first started, I really started the information security program myself. So it was kind of the first product we bought that we built everything around. So it really is the kind of the central repository for everything we're doing from, a, from an information security program standpoint. I would say longer than on a scale of one to 10 would be a nine. I think it's a really solid solution. I think one of the things that they could probably improve on, as I mentioned, was being kind of a little more proactive when it comes to things like cloud and things like that. So I think that they are getting better, but I'd say a nine right now.